Hello everyone and welcome to today's presentation on Mycobacterium tuberculosis. Understanding Mycobacterium tuberculosis, a comprehensive overview. So what is Mycobacterium tuberculosis? Mycobacterium tuberculosis or M tuberculosis for short is a bacterium that causes tuberculosis, a contagious and potentially deadly infectious disease. TB is a major global health concern affecting millions of people worldwide. Did you know that about a quarter of the global population is estimated to have been infected with TB bacteria? and around 5 to 10 percentage of those infected will eventually develop to TB disease. So what is this TB and what is uh, specific about this bacterium? So mycobacterium is a slow growing bacteria and one of the key features of mycobacterium tuberculosis is its unique cell wall structure. It's composed of complex lipids including mycolic acids which makes it uh, incredibly resilient and resistant to many antibiotics. This is one of the reasons why uh, tuberculosis can be so difficult to treat. Coming to the taxonomy, currently there are more than 770 species of mycobacterium and this can be grouped into two categories, group 1 and group 2. Group 1 uh, is the TB complex organisms which include Mycobacterium tuberculosis, uh, Mycobacterium bovis, Mycobacterium africanum and other rare species of Mycobacterium. And group 2 includes Mycobacterium other than TB complex or also known as the MOT. It is referred to as non-tuberculosis uh, Mycobacterium. How we can identify or what are the identification techniques uh, for this Mycobacterium tuberculosis? The accurate identification of uh, Mycobacterium tuberculosis is crucial for diagnosis and treatment. There are various techniques like uh, acid wash staining, culturing on specialized media and uh, molecular methods like PCR are available to identify. So recent advances in uh, molecular diagnostic point of care testing has improved the turnaround times for identifying the disease. Dress susceptibility testing is essential to determine the most effective treatment regimen. Coming to the pathogenesis, uh, mycobacterium tuberculosis primarily causes pulmonary TB when it uh, affects the lens. But it can also affect other parts of the body leading to extrapulmonary TB such as TB meningitis, bone TB and abdominal TB. The inhaled TB reaches the lungs. It can be in one of these three forms. In 50% of the cases, it is cleared without any infection. It may cause latent infection only. On the other hand, it can develop to active infection. So any of three of these can happen. In case of latent infection, uh, when uh, when the person is malnutrition or uh, immunocompromised, uh, this can become an active infection. Let's see how this is transmitted. Well, uh, it's primarily spread through the uh, inhalation of respiratory dro droplets containing the uh, bacteria and close contact with an infectious individual is the most common way it spreads. Factors like uh, crowded living conditions and uh, compromised immune system can increase the risk of transmission. TB rebinds a significant global health concern. Each year, over 10 million people develop active TB, leading to about 1.5 million deaths. It uh, disproportionately affects low and middle income countries where the resource for uh, diagnosis and treatment can be limited. There are many challenges uh, in the TB control drug resistant TB strains like multi drug uh, TB resistance and MDR TB and extensively drug resistant TB like XDR TB are a major concern. Socioeconomic factors, stigma, and inadequate healthcare infrastructure also hinder TB control effects. What are the current research and future uh, prospects? The ongoing research efforts are aimed to develop new TB diagnostics, drugs, and vaccines. The global community is working together to achieve the sustainable developmental goal of ending the TB epidemic by the year 2030. So the global impact of uh, TB is substantial and addressing this uh, public health challenge requires continued research, innovation and international cooperation. So I have included uh, links to the recent uh, TB global report from uh, WHO. Those who are interested can check this from the links in the description. Thank you for listening. If you like this video, please share and comment.